Well, good morning. Bom dia, as we would say in Portuguese. Um, we're very, very, very happy to be here today. And I wrote myself a little speech because I know I would stutter if I didn't. <laughs> Globally, more and more people are becoming aware of how precious nature and its resources are. So today, we, the Brazilian community and associates, have united forces to present a small amount of the, some of the wonders of the Amazon River and its surroundings. I'm sorry I'm shaking. <laughs> we invite you to stay for as long as you like and enjoy the music, theater, art, and stories until 2 p.m. Thank you all very, very much. Today, we're going to take a trip to a very, very amazing place, far, far away. It's called the Amazon River. Yeah, the Amazon River. Because when we're talking about water, rivers, we must talk about the Amazon River. After all, it's the second longest river in the whole world. <laughs> second longest. Yeah. I would say they should call it a draw, because it's really long, like it's 6,800 kilometers. It's like four times the length of New Zealand. Imagine that, it's like going from Cape Ranga all the way down to Bluff and back, twice. That's how long it is. The river is so long, it crosses the whole South America. It goes all the way from the east and comes out on the west. Second longest. Okay, I can take that. Second longest is fine. But that's when you're talking about the length. If you talk about the volume of water, oh, the Amazon River is the biggest. How? Oh, by far. By far. The Amazon River is responsible for 20% of the fresh water on Earth that goes into the ocean. It all starts in the Andes Mountains in Peru, Arequipa. The river has a different name there, Rio Ucayali. There's so many, so much water, so many people, so much life around it. There are a lot of stories as well. 